Hey, what's going on guys? So I'm gonna show you some tips and tricks on how to get the best value in the best seats on StubHub. Um, I oftentimes go to concerts, Red Sox games, Patriots games, Celtics, and a lot of times I can get those tickets at half of face value, if not a better deal. And I'm gonna show you a little run, run around StubHub and how to do it. So I'm here at the Ed Sheehan concert that's coming up in Gillette on September. It's way off. But the first thing you want to do when you look for tickets is you don't want to go under best seats because they're going to be all jacked up, overpriced here. So go to best value. So you're going to get a status indicator here from one to five bars. Usually five bars like this means that it's a great value to purchase those tickets. Um, this far in advance, you'd want to check on Ticketmaster too to see if there's still tickets available and price them out uh, with that as well. But what I often do is the day of the event, up until maybe ten, even ten, five or ten minutes before the event starts, I'll buy my tickets on StubHub because um, often you'll find sellers who are just drastically dropping prices at half a face value, dropping them even further down just to get rid of the tickets and get some some value out of that. So that's one of my biggest tips right there. However, if they're very limited tickets to the event so if I was a week out on this event and there was let's say less than a hundred tickets I'd worry and I would try to scavenge uh, something up even if I paid more than face value but one example I want to show you right now is the Super Bowl tickets so we will go to Super Bowl here so last week when these tickets first went up, the cheapest tickets I saw were, let me see here, were $3,900. So we're a week out and they're down to $2,600. I'd guarantee you if tickets still stay relevant as many tickets that are on here right now, these tickets are going to go for less than 2000 I wouldn't be surprised if you can get a Super Bowl ticket for 1500 or less. So if I was going to the Super Bowl, I'd keep an eye on this, and I would try to at least get my ticket $1,500 uh, in that ballpark, which is a phenomenal deal, considering that the average ticket price is around $4,300, they're saying on the media. So that's it, guys. It's, it's pretty simple. Um, oftentimes, too, when you buy them on your phone, they'll scan them in the barcodes and the Q codes at the uh, at the door so you can buy them right on your phone at the event but make sure your phone's fully charged because I can't tell you how many times my phone's been dead when I've showed up to an event so good luck guys